So here I am again with another Windows 7 video. This time I'm testing out uh, Google Chrome OS on VirtualBox. And um, all I'm going to say is um, this is a different type of operating system. This is not uh, hard drive based or uh, everything is practically online. It's called cloud computing. Meaning to say, when you log on to the Google Chrome OS, you automatically log on to their servers. That's pretty much how it is. And what you're seeing right now is just the interface that will run all the applications online. And uh, as you can see, pretty much it's, uh, it's, it's a Chrome browser with a control panel, as you can see right now. Now this is only in beta mode and it's not officially released just yet. So um, there are a bit of um, lots of glitches and bugs and even uh, really slow performance. Uh, then again, I'm I'm not sure if it's the virtual box or could be Google Chrome OS or maybe the VMware compilation. But all I know is it's it's just a bit slow when trying to click through things. It's it's a bit delayed, so you can see. When I'm moving my mouse over, it's a bit delayed. But uh, I'm sure um, if I run it on another partition, it'd be smooth. But right now, it's uh, this is a VMware, so I mean VirtualBox. You can run this on VMware, but so far, it's uh, I don't know how to really improve it. This is how much I can go through. <laughs> um, but yeah, so that's pretty much it. There's really nothing more to a Google Chrome OS. It's simple, it's easy to use, and um, this is not uh, for the, P the hardcore PC users or hardcore Mac users, um, but for people who are on netbooks or on the go all the time and they just need to check their email, or it, it's pretty much, uh, yeah, that's pretty much for those types of people who are on the go. Um, who don't really spend their time on the computer and they just need to check what they need to do like email, uh, YouTube, uh, whatever they need, basic stuff. But it doesn't mean that they're stopping in at that direction. But what Google is trying to do is they're trying to advance everything all online. So all the information you have, your email, your applications, everything's going to be online. So that's what they're trying to show. It's going to be cloud computing. Um, which is a it's, a it's a great idea it's a great idea and uh, yeah people are still wondering about security and this and that you know what about security of course everyone's thinking about security you know but the thing is um, everyone uses MySpace Facebook we pretty much give all the information to them so what's the difference between uh, Google share, uh, holding your information look at your Gmail account or your Hotmail account your Yahoo your 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 emails are practically on servers already, so uh, that's pretty much the company's uh, responsibility to keep it secure. So Google knows what they're doing, and you shouldn't be all ranting like crazy just yet. Um, and I I can't really benchmark this because <laughs> it's it's all online. It's not. A hardware issue it's it's really all about the network issue but uh, you can even play games but then again the games are practically online so it's really you know um, and that's pretty much it there's really nothing more you got your time I'll just click it through yeah your basic options it's pretty much chrome integrated into an operating system with a control panel uh nothing more but uh for now i'd prefer using the chrome browser because it's faster <laughs> and it connects faster and i can tab really fast <laughs> uh but uh, jokes aside um for those who want want to test it out you can you can you can find it online uh, you can torrent it if you want. Um, but I'd wait until they actually release an official beta. So right now, this is just, you know, a gist of what they're trying to do. But if you go look at uh, YouTube on the Google Chrome channel, 
you can actually find uh you can you can actually find the what do you call this you can actually find the, the their new uh, ui interface demo that they're trying to work on so you never know things can change in a couple of months so we'll wait till then and there's your preview of google chrome os <laughs>